drag this out into the, uh, a whole other next few days. But just, you know, when we talked to you yesterday, it was still before the, um, the pregame ceremony. I kind of wanted to just get your thoughts on how that felt, you know, after having done it, being out there with uh, you know, kneeling before the anthem and then people standing. I just I wanted to get a maybe a, a, a post-game from you on that. How did yeah, you it was, uh, you know, the thing, the thing is there's been so many conversations within our clubhouse um, with so many different, you know, not only as a group, but, you know, personal, you know, personal conversations with each of these guys. Um, it's a deep issue. It's a very, very deep issue. So, you know, I just get frustrated when people look at it from the peripheral and just say, okay, you made this decision. This is what you stand for. It's like there's so many thoughts and emotions and feelings that go into every decision you make like that. It was pretty powerful for me. Um, you know, there's something I have a lot of, you know, very, very, very close friends of mine that are African American, um, and have had many conversations about the injustices that they've had to deal with, um, the, the experiences. I'm not basing this on any kind of numbers or any political party or anything like that. These are just experiences that I've personally heard from these, you know, people. Um, and they're powerful. They're very, very powerful to me, you know, and, and the empathy that I have for them and what they've had to go through, I haven't had to go through. So I just felt, you know what, if if our players are willing to, you know, put themselves on the line like that, you know, and we weren't, we were standing for the anthem. That's one thing I want to make clear. Like a lot of people, you know, didn't understand what was happening at that point. And, I, you know, I don't read social media or do anything too often, but I heard some comments that made me angry. Like, you know, we all stood for the anthem. So if people don't see that and they're not willing to look and see and read um, into the details of what happened last night, we did not disrespect our flag. We did not disrespect our country. We were standing for racial equality or we were kneeling for racial equality in support of that um, in the fight against social injustice. That was it. That was it for me. And, you know, I stood alongside our guys and I felt that that was important. So it was a pretty powerful moment for me. And I know that you know, I wanted to make sure I had my players and my staff members back and everybody in our organization and everybody in our country for that matter with that, that are African-American.